Hey guys, how you all doing? This is NKD Smart View. So right now, I'll be teaching you how to place the bet on the multiple plus system. Very fast, very easy and simple. All you have to do is to look for a compatible site. Let's say a compatible platform like MSport and any platform which you're able to stake this on that has good odds. So what do we do now? First things first is to proceed over to the games of the day. So let's tap on soccer. Once you do that, we'll be making use of our tennis. Tennis is the best for this now because tennis is very predictable. One man must always be stronger than another. It does not require team effort. It doesn't require team effort that you can see that probably if a particular team member is not present, then it affects the result. Not at all. It doesn't um, require team effort. It's a one man to one man or in some cases they have tournaments whereby two people play against two people. So it's, it's um, either within a one man or a two person gameplay so it's very easy to predict because once one person is better than the other there's a high tendency that is going to win that or at the very worst you get some losses that is why this technique is in use so the first thing you do now is what get over to your game then don't make the mistake of what selecting games that will go for a long period of time that day is good enough so tap on your today's game once you tap on your today's game now next thing you should do is what apply it once you apply it to this game now start looking all the way from what this is the time currently now is at 12 57 pm very good and very fine 12 57 pm so what do i do now um this match start by 105 so we are, we don't even need to go with that because the odds is not favorable to us now our odds should be from what between 1.20 our odds the odds will be going with should be between 1.20 to 1.50 something it must not be less than 1.20 it must not be more than 1.50 something 1.57 55 59 good enough then we select just what 20 games so this is what you have to do now first of all click here first game click here good and don't select very low odds so much the fact that an odd is low does not mean it will win that's the major thing the major winning factor here is what two things first of all play multiple tickets per day then the second is what playing games that has good odds so let's proceed on that now so third game here fourth game 1.40 Fifth game 1 1.50, 1.50, 1.50, 1.49, 1.35, 1.30, 1.40. And make sure you try to mix it up. There must be not 1.50 must not be much. Neither should 1.20 be much. It should be in between. And once you're done with your game, you'll be able to what calculate it and know if it's balanced or not. So you know what to remove and what to add. So that's it, um, 1.50, 1.30, we are at 15 now, 1.30, 1.20, 1.40, 40, then the final game, 1.30. To me, this game is balanced based on the odds. We have an odd of what, 800 plus, so the game is good enough and is balanced. So let's check it out. We have what, 1.20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 4, good enough. 1 by 1.30, 1, 2, 3, 4 good enough what about 1.40 1 2 3 4 5 6 good enough 1.50 it's 1 2 3 4 5 so 5 that's good enough it's settled we don't have anyone ranging 8 or there about then another one 2 every is good enough 4 to 4 to 6 to 5 and all so that's good enough but from the odds you know whenever the odds is within this range of 800 plus it's good enough 700 to good enough but once it starts getting to 400 it's bad or you start seeing something like 1000 plus is also bad so consider that then the next thing you should do is to what look at the amount you're using to play now your total response is at 133,217 naira but this is what you do now you start bringing it down this is the option you see this yellow arrow pointing down you tap on it a particular selection goes down now you have what two series here of how to play the game now you saw that what the money has gone down all the way from hundred and something thousand to ten thousand it's like that and it keeps on going lower as you keep on reducing now this second option here is the option of what very risky don't even go with it i don't even go near there this option is trying to let you know that what if your score one of our games are out one has started let's choose another let's choose another so let's go with something 1.30 yeah 1.30 is good to add the game is then too low 500 and something else that's bad 1.50 okay that's good enough so that's it so looking at it right now what do you see it shows you that what if you have what 19 correct score which is the normal one i play with it has what you win 9500 plus it's still going i accepted all changes so odds will keep on changing 
they don't have to ask me if i want to accept it or not it just automatically keeps on changing and games are just starting and keeps on starting so we have to be fast with this 500 or something 1.30 is good enough yeah so that's it um looking at this now you have what selection of what 19 then 20 and 19 this particular second selection is telling you that what if 20 of your game comes you win this amount of 57,000 but if 19 comes you win what 2,500 but this is the main selection you should go with is this one that has a plus it carries the plus sign shows you that it's from this range to that range if you go below 18 now you see what 18 to 19 but here is 18 plus that means if 20 enters you get something as if 18 enters but look at the odds now the odds of getting 18 and 19 is what 1.87 it's not favorable to us because the other odd is 21 why is it like that is that that because the 20 correct score here shows you that what once you get 20 correct you win the amount of 41,000 naira do you understand that means they you actually have a possibility of still winning big money from this unlike the fact of you using what this first option that reduces the odd now to 25.94 and you're currently at what 2700 naira this other option gives you the opportunity that even if everything wins you will still what win good money that is why once you don't win up to that 20 it brings your odd down very drastically so let's go over now down to 17 down to 16 and to our final 15 plus now at 15 plus we have what 1.80 odds this is a good odds you should select between 1.40 and above so 1.40 to 1.80 it should not exceed 1.80 it should not exceed what 1.40 below go below 1.40 so looking at that now you can see something look at the our 20 to 20 correct score now what can you see here you still have 20 236 odds 230 something odds showing you that what if you win the whole 20 as of this point you win what 223,000 plus but if you win between 15 to 19 you are getting what 0.01 odd that's horrible that means your money is gone it's as good as you what losing all your money there's no difference for you playing multiple and playing this system because at the end of the day if you do not win up to your 20 games you are still losing so make sure you take note you are making use of this first selection here of 15 plus correct games you can't go below 15 you can't remove anything more than five from your games if you carry 10 games you can remove five if you carry what 20 games you can only remove five let's try that now so you have seen the technique all you have to do is to what use this arrow moving what down to reduce your game to the quantity you need keep on reducing it to the quantity so starting from 20 19 18 17 16 and below now let's say you have just 10 selections right now let's say you have just 10 selections right now you can see that what it's only five you can what remove even if it's 10 selections even if you have what just 10 selections now we have an um, on screen how many selections 13 i believe and most have started already now we have on screen 13 selections we have on screen 10 selections now now from 10 selections you can see you can go all the way low to what five four and all but not advisable the reason being because look at your odds now start going down drastically now we are at odds of 0 0.75 even them are telling you that this option cannot be selected when odds is lower than 1.05 that means anything less than 1.05 you can't play the game now let's get over to four find yourself at what 0 0.78 get over to 5 0 0.6 that to show you that what after five selection of below five you can see that you are making no profit now going to six you are currently at what 1.05 Get over to seven now so what is this showing you that you can only play this from what seven to ten but my issue with this playing low games like this is the fact that at the end of the day you find out that something happens the possibility of you making the returns is harder when you play 20 games you can be able to what slot in little little odds that can get me in favor of you but once you play so little games like five ga um seven games to get three or get four you find out that was the odds is so bad and then you can also lose on the long run so that is something else to be considered while making your gameplay so think about that well and know how to select these games how to select your games is the major thing i just randomly picked this but before you do that you have to what make calculation like as you saw i did i selected the games to some particular odds you have to also be odds conscious select the games to some particular odds then you make your move like if you watch the previous video before this now you would have seen what um the gameplays that we are currently ongoing not all we win out of it but when you select like seven to ten games a day you can be able to win like what six out of it and if you win six let's say all six are what 50 1.50 1.50 you make good profit you use 1000 there to stake and you played um seven games with seven thousand you are, you, you are making what one five per game 
times this game is what 9000 naira because you don't majorly lose all even if you lose two you still make what seven five that means you are still making a profit of close to almost 10 percent of what you used consistency is the major thing so if you can be able to play seven tickets per day and win what at least five you are making profit every day but the major time you start making loss is when you what win like six and um win like five and below five out of seven that's when you know that you're going on loss so consider that and that's all i have to say for now till another time once i'm done with another update i'll drop it up for you guys to follow up